Welcome to Juicy J's cooking show, where I may or may not fail. I'll let you decide. Today we're making creamy jalapeno dip. Okay, I'm gonna start with two jalapenos. Now, if you don't want it as spicy, take out the seeds. I'm gonna throw, like cut this off and just throw the whole thing in uh, my Ninja. Now, if you have a food processor, you could use that. I'm just gonna use like my blender. I'm also gonna use like a bundle of cilantro, half cup of mayo, use whatever kind you want, a half cup of sour cream. And I'm gonna throw in one of like these ranch packets. Um, I didn't have any buttermilk on hand, so guess what? I made some. Basically, I took two um, percent milk, one cup of it, and then I took some lemon juice, like um, one tablespoon, and then poured it in there, and you just let it sit for 10 minutes, and you can kind of see it starting to curd a little bit. Anyway, so that's what I got going on. And then I also use salt, pepper, and then I'm going to use garlic salt to taste. So let's get started. You don't have to really chop up anything. Everything's just gonna be poured straight into my Ninja. Oh my gosh, I can't breathe. Okay, that's chopped up, the jalapenos. There's some cilantro. I'm not gonna measure, but I'm just gonna throw in like a scoop full of sour cream and then do the same thing with some mayo. I'm also gonna throw in my ranch packet and then mix this together. <laughs> Having a food processor would make this job a lot easier, but you know what, I'm just making this work. Now I'm gonna scrape the sides to get all this, and then I'm gonna add the buttermilk into it, and that's just gonna help it so it's not so thick. I made a cup, but I'm gonna just start pouring in a half cup and see if I need any more. That's a pretty good consistency. So now I'm gonna salt, pepper, and add some garlic salt. Okay, so I end up pouring the rest of that milk in there because I really don't need it um, for later. And I seasoned it and you're the chef. So taste test it to your liking. I can't taste, so Thomas is gonna do mine for me. Okay, I would suggest serving this with like holiday festive like red or green uh chips or whatever i have these in my pantry so that's what we're going to eat it with here we go honey hot what do you think thomas that's amazing very good and if you think it's too hot don't add the seeds but 10 out of 10 recommend honey hush